Previously on the Steve Saga. Rainbow Steve? Oh, what's up? You see that right there? Um, I see a... Oh, oh. Is that, is that Galaxy Steve? This could be a trap to lure us out of the base and to leave Purple oh, Steve man. alone. Yeah, I know. You're, you're right. But at the same time, what if it's actually Galaxy Steve, man? Come on, Galaxy... Oh, wait, he's not running. Galaxy Steve? Uh, hey, Rainbow Steve. And hey, S Saber. Galaxy Steve? Is that actually you? Saber? Ra Rainbow Steve? Yeah. Oh, oh my gosh, I, it's you guys. Yeah, it's it's you, us. I don't understand how- you, well, You're okay. I mean, yeah. I'm not really okay. You're not seeing me exactly. But I am, you're literally right there. I can see you, I'm not- It's it's not really me though. It's it's a projection of my inner self. I'm, I'm in a different dimension right now, guys. And and I and I kind of need your help. I don't understand. You're literally right here. How is that? I I'm so confused. And also, it's, not only that, why were you running away from us? If if it, if it's you, then why wouldn't you just talk to us immediately? I'm sorry, guys. I was just I was just scared and and afraid. I I thought you guys weren't gonna believe me, and and I just didn't know what to do. Okay, okay. Look, calm down. I'm just happy that you're okay. Kind of. I don't really. I I'm sorry. So you're you're saying that you're a projection of yourself, and you're not here. Oh, what? Galaxy Steve. Galaxy Steve. Oh. Ooh, where'd he go? Galaxy Steve, are you okay? Hello? Oh, oh hey, no. I'm here. Oh, I'm my here. No, gosh. It's okay. okay, okay. So I, was, right. I just I just don't have that much power to be able to project myself for very long, so I can only do it for a short amount of time before I have to go back to my dimension. Okay, wait. So you're saying that since you don't have enough energy, you're you're just you're blinking in and out of this dimension? Exactly. I'm, I'm almost, as you could say, a, a, a phantom. I'm not really in this dimension with you guys, but I can at least try to be here and help guide you guys or at least tell you that i need help wait hang on hang on hang on this is too confusing i saw you literally explode and turn into a black hole we saw it in front of our very eyes i don't understand how this is actually possible you're in a different dimension now you should be gone i i should have been gone but right before i blew up i was able to divert some of my power and instead of blowing up and consuming everything with the black hole i kind of spread myself across the dimensions if if that makes any sense whatsoever so the black hole was a part of me but not but not completely me wait so uh, when we closed the black hole what happened to you then it was able to give me back some of my power and i was able to regain strength but on a completely different dimension which i'm gonna need your help to get out of here well then what dimension are you oh no oh, oh no oh, oh here we on. go again come on galaxy steve come on where are you please don't leave us right now we still need to get answers i'm here i'm back oh my i'm gosh. back guys okay look if you are in a different dimension. I don't understand. You're saying you're like a phantom right now? That what, what dimension could you even be in to be able to do any of this? I don't know. It's a different dimension for sure, but it's not like any other one I've ever been before. It's it's almost like, like, a, like a phantom dimension or a... I don't know. It's just... It's very, very strange. I've never seen or been here before. Look, it doesn't matter. We're going to get you out of there, okay? We've been trying to get you out of there. Uh, and without even knowing where you were, we've been trying to save you. I went into the black hole that you created, and a lot went down in there, but it was weird. It didn't act like a black hole. It was almost like it was his own... Wait a second. It was like it was its own dimension. Does that mean when you blew up, you might have accidentally created multiple dimensions just from that? What? I'm... He could do that? I don't know. I mean, he is the one that's create. He oversees the universe and everything, and if you don't know how to use your abilities when you blew up. Maybe that's why you don't know the dimension. Maybe it's a new one that you're in on accident. That is actually a very good explanation. That very well could be what happened. I I don't know. All I know is I tried my best to, you know, make it so the universe itself didn't end. I could be in a brand new dimension. And if that's the case, I'm going to need your help to get out because there's no known way to get out except if I have power. So... I'm going to need to get a lot of power back. Okay, all right, all right. We're going to do this. We got this. But we have another problem, Galaxy Steve. I'm guessing if you were able to see somewhat of what's going on in this dimension, Void Steve is here. I don't know if you remember exactly who he was, but he was the guy that sent Memory Steve after us. Memory Steve is the minion of Void Steve. I don't know if your memories are that, you know, intact, but I'm pretty sure he's the one that you were dealing with back before you lost all of your memories. Vo Void Steve, he's here? That's... 
That's every that was the guy. No, no, he can't okay. Be here. This isn't good. This isn't good. This oh. And he's gone. Rainbow Steve, we need to make sure that we get whatever info info we get, we need out of Galaxy Steve before he just completely vanishes. He's probably using yeah. a lot of energy, but I, I hope he comes back. Oh, oh, maybe you could tell us more about. I'm back. Uh, and he, oh. oh, and he's on the llama. Okay, look, Galaxy Steve, don't panic. Okay, you're using more oh, energy God. than you need to if you start panicking okay. and going crazy. Okay. Yeah. No, that, you're right. You're right. I I have to I have to get a hold of myself. I can't panic and use energy. And if I panic. If I'm if I panic, it's not gonna be good, and I'm gonna and I'm use a bunch of energy, and then all of a sudden okay. I'm just gonna oh, disappear. Okay, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, 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 and he's going in. All right, this is bad. This is bad. Yeah, how we, are we need to get more information out of him so we know more about Void Steve and how Look, to beat him? I know, man. I know. But how are we gonna do this if he keeps on coming back and panicking? Okay. Where is okay. He? Oh, okay. Okay. I'm right. back. I'm okay. okay. Deep all right, just calm down. All right, everyone, oh, yeah. just take a deep breath here, <sighs> and we. <laughs> All right, it doesn't seem like Steve's really know how to take deep breaths still. All right, look, Galaxy Steve, relax. We're going to help you, okay? And yeah, Void Steve is in this dimension, and we now know about him. And he could technically be watching us right now, but I, I don't know. Maybe he isn't, because if he saw you were here, then he'd be attacking us immediately. We have no way of actually stopping him, Galaxy Steve. We tried to, and he seems invincible. He can remove giant pieces of land in just the blink of an eye. I don't understand how we could even do anything against him. He's basically unstoppable from what it seems. I hate to tell you this, but you're going to have to try to capture him, or at least take some of his energy, because his energy is what's gonna need to be used to get out of the dimension I'm in. So you're saying that we have to harvest his energy to use to make some type of machine to get you out of there? How the heck are we gonna do that? That guy can fly and destroy tons of land and everything. We'll be able right. to reach him. Galaxy Steve, it's a lot harder than you think. I don't know if you remember exactly what he's capable of, but he's even able to take over Steve's. He controlled our friend Purple Steve, who's, I don't know, I think he's down there somewhere. You might not remember it all, but Void Steve is definitely a lot more evil and a lot stronger than probably what you remember. I'm not sure we're just gonna be able to so easily just capture his energy and just use it to create a machine for you. I, I don't know. I think it's the only way. And I think the biggest problem is Void Steve's energy is the polar opposite of mine. And for it to be usable with me, you'll have to be able to swap the energy somehow. You'll have to convert it into good energy. Because if we put evil energy into me, it's I'm afraid of what could possibly happen. I think I know how we can do that, but I just feel so bad. We've already done this so many times before, Rainbow Steve. I think I know how we can convert the energy, but do you think it would be too much? I think you know I what I'm talking know. about. I don't know. I mean, we're going to have to test it out. Just to be sure. Galaxy Steve, we can do it, but our friend Purple Steve might be the key to this. He's able to use his abilities, and he's converted energy before, so obviously he can do it this time. But the only issue is he's already done this so many times before, I'm scared that he might not be able to handle it this time. Especially Void Steve's energy. That's a lot of power. That's very, very powerful energy. If... If Purple Steve isn't strong enough, I'm very scared to what could happen to him. Are you saying that he could possibly turn evil? He could turn evil or worse. I don't want to think about that. Look, Galaxy Steve, we are going to get you out of there, and I guess... That is a good suggestion that we could try and harness Void Steve's energy. We're just going to have to figure out exactly how... Oh, oh. and he's gone again. Okay, all right. Galaxy Steve, please tell Galaxy me you're going to come Steve. back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm please. sorry. I... I'm slowly but surely running out of energy. I can tell. I'm holding on to a bare, bare minimum. And if I run out of energy this time, it's over for good. Oh, no, 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 no. G no Galaxy we, have, we, have, we have to hurry. Please, is there anything else that we need to know before we get you out of there? Is there anything in that dimension that you're in right now that we need to know about before we just open some type of portal to it? I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't think so. I think the only thing is I just need a lot of energy. And I think you guys need to make one of your machines... If you make the machine, I should be able to, to sense the energy. It just has to be big enough, and from there, I might be able to come to you guys. Okay, Rainbow Steve, I think we can do this. Galaxy Steve, just stay alert and get ready to feel for the energy, okay? I don't know where Void Steve is or what he's up to or what he's even doing right now, but what I do know is he definitely wants to completely destroy us. He's even been toying with us. Maybe we can use that to our advantage. He feels so powerful, maybe he's getting a little too confident. We can use that against him. I don't really I have, have I have an idea. I'll, I'll be right back, okay? Okay. Wait, didn't he say that if he disappears again, he wouldn't come back? Galaxy Steve, please tell me that you're able to come back again. Come on, man. Are you serious? I don't oh. think he's coming back, Saber. You said you had an idea. You better show us what the idea was. No, come on. Oh, this is just fantastic. We barely know anything about this new enemy. Void Steve is really powerful, but Galaxy Steve has already shown us that he's stronger than we thought. Kind of seemed like he was gone forever. There, if he was gone forever. I'm back. Oh, oh, Galaxy Steve, you scared us, man. I thought you were going to be gone forever this time. It's okay. I, I have enough power to go back and forth it's just if i run out of power 
that's when it's the problem. I have an idea. This might help. I grabbed a crystal from the dimension that I'm in. And maybe if you put this in the machine that you build, maybe it'll be easier to channel the energy to me. Okay, I think this could work. Thank you, Galaxy Steve. This could be the answer right here. If we use the Phantom Crystal, then maybe this actually will open the connection a lot easier. Galaxy Steve, thank you so much for actually helping us out here, and we're gonna get you out, all right? Okay, I, I need to conserve energy, so if you need, just, just try to call and I'll be there. But the longer I'm in this dimension, the more power I drain. Okay, listen, we're gonna make it easy on you. We're gonna try not to even try and get you back here until we actually have the way, of, uh, way for you to get out, all right? So you just conserve your energy and we will call for you, but I highly doubt we're going to actually need you unless, I don't know. I mean, it's not like you could handle Void Steve on your own like this, right? You don't have enough energy for that. I don't, I don't have enough energy at all. I'll, I will definitely need to weaken Void Steve and get energy for myself. How about your memories? Do you have any of those back yet or are they still they're, kind of they're slowly coming back to me. I don't have everything yet, but I'm sure if we take Void's power and we put it into me, I'm sure I will gain much more of my memories. I still worry. What if we don't transfer Void Steve's energy properly and we just put evil energy into you. What'll happen to you then? I fear for what might happen then. Okay, well, we'll make sure we don't make that mistake. Right, Rainbow Steve? Right. Well, Galaxy Steve, how about you You just get on out of here? I'll hold on to this phantom crystal and I won't lose it, I promise. Okay, best of luck, my friends. And that's that. We know what we gotta do. I, I think I do know what we have to do, but I think we're gonna have to talk to Purple Steve. We should probably fill him in since- Yeah, yeah, we have to do it because like, this is big news. We thought the galaxy is evil destroyed, but now he's okay. Well, sort of okay. He's just stuck in a different dimension, but we should go tell Purple Steve immediately. Look, I'm so just worried, just though. Wait, hang on, Rainbow Steve. I'm just worried because if we bring it up to Purple Steve, it's great news that Galaxy Steve is still okay, but to get him back, we're going to need Purple Steve's power again, and he's already done it so many times. Not only is it just getting repetitive now, which I wish we had some other way to do this, I, I just, I don't know. I feel like he'll just feel obligated to do this because he's such a good guy, you know? Saber, didn't you hear Galaxy Steve? The more he's in that dimension, the more his powers drain. I know, it's a catch-22. If we wait any longer and try and figure out another way, Galaxy Steve could be hurt. But if we do it faster, there's a chance that Purple Steve could get hurt. I don't know if there's any way out of this that doesn't end up getting another Steve hurt. Purple Steve will be fine, but we need to go save Galaxy Steve before it's too late. All right, let's just go talk to him and see what he thinks. I don't know. I won't do it if he's not okay with it. All right, if he's not okay with it, then... All right, fine. All right. We'll find some other way. Purple Steve? Hey! Hey, Purple Steve. Hey, why don't you, uh, why don't we get on out of this cave real quick, and I want to talk to you. Oh, you're back! Yeah, yeah, we are back, and we are... Oh, man, okay. Uh, we... A lot's just happened. A lot has uh, just happened. We went out here to try and think and stuff, and you could be relaxing and all of that, and all, you know, and whatnot, but we found Galaxy Steve. Galaxy Steve is okay, kind of. I, I don't know how to put it, but we saw him. We talked to him, and what? He's alive? Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, kind of. Okay, it's confusing. Galaxy Steve is, is he's in some type of phantom dimension, and he talked to us by using his energy to try and communicate with us to this dimension, but he used a lot of his energy, and apparently we helped gather him back together when we closed that black hole, so we did save him in a sense from that, but now we're gonna have to try and get him out of that phantom dimension, and in order to do that, we need a large, large, large amount of energy, and well, he told us how to get that large amount of energy, but it's not gonna be good. It's by using Void Steve's energy, which means that we're gonna have to somehow drain it out of him. It's... Not really the best situation. I'm not so sure this is a good idea. I don't think it's a good idea either, but Galaxy Steve even told us that he couldn't think of any other way to do it. Not only that, there's one more thing to it. If we do somehow even get Void Steve's energy, he's the most evil person we've ever seen. Which means that if we want to use that energy to try and get Galaxy Steve out of that phantom dimension and actually bring Galaxy Steve back together here, well, we need to try and transform that evil energy into good energy. And that would require your help because you're the only Steve that we know right now that can actually transfer energy like that. Just like how you did with the other energy that we've done before. And I know it's a lot to ask of you, but I promise we won't ask it, ask it of you anymore, okay? If we can get Galaxy Steve back, then there shouldn't even be any need for any of us to have to do any of this anymore ever again. Galaxy Steve will yeah. be back. He can save we'll us. Be, yeah, we'll be all set. I don't know. I'm still feeling kind of weak. I won't force you to do anything, okay? You don't have to do it if you don't want to, but I don't think there is another way currently. We can look for another way, but every moment spent trying to find the other way is the moments that we're missing out on Galaxy Steve getting here faster. He's using his energy to try and stay put together in that other dimension. He doesn't have a lot left. If he runs out, we won't be able to 
to get him out of there at all. It's just sad that it's time sensitive. We're just kind of stuck. We're we're in quite we're in quite the pickle, man. Oh, so not with the pickles again. It's just it's just a saying. I'm not saying actual pickles. I'm just oh yeah. D don't oh, worry. Okay. About it. Purple Steve, I know that you've been through a lot. We've all been through a lot. And if you don't really want to do this, then we won't force you. But it would mean a lot if you could help us get Galaxy Steve out of there. And once Galaxy Steve is out of there, maybe once we get him all put together, we could help you out too. I don't know. Maybe we can get him to restore your energy, and maybe we could even get you to go back to your dimension. Again, it's up to you, but what do you say? All right, fine, I'm in. But I can't help you guys once I use my powers. Look, I'll keep you safe, okay? Okay, I'll make sure that nothing happens to anyone ever again here. You know, at least for the time being. I have no idea what else we'll actually see. But with Void Steve, getting his powers and transferring all that energy, when it comes to making machines, I'm pretty sure I can keep you safe, okay? So there's no need to worry about that. So if that sounds like a plan, then I guess let's just go get the resources and we can put it together. Galaxy Steve gave me this phantom crystal. He was able to put it together with some of the last bits of his energy. If we can integrate it with the machine that we make, Purple Steve, it should make it easier on you to use the energy and put him back together. So it shouldn't be so hard on you now, all right? I think we can do this, guys. We can do this and we get Galaxy Steve back. Oh, I'm really excited, Saber. I am too. I'm happy to get Galaxy Steve back. Why don't we all just take a break here? Uh, Rainbow Steve, why don't you go get us some supplies for the machines? On it! Purple Steve, try and get your energy back together. How about those memory helmets? Did you absorb those? I'd assume so. You seem you seem better. Yeah, I was able to. Cool. So why don't you kind of get in that mindset of getting ready to, you know, transform evil energy into good energy and uh we'll we'll call it from we'll call it now for now, okay? I'll come get you when we're ready. Guys, we're gonna call it here for today. If you guys think that this is a good idea, let us know down in the comment section below. Hit that like button, check out Rainbow Steve's channel down in the description below as well. He uploads daily videos. Uh let's shoot for 3,000 likes, subscribe, turn on notifications. I think we can do this. We saw Galaxy Steve, so that's that's great. As always, I'm your host, Sabrina, and I'll see you tomorrow with another daily Minecraft video. Peace.